Hello there, CHC speaking. In this video, we will show you how to perform a survey with the Alpha Air 450 LiDAR using a single button. Let's go. We've arrived at the survey site. Our mission has already been planned and uploaded to the controller. All that's left is performing the survey itself. The first step is turning on the base station. It will record static data at the frequency of at least one hertz and transmit RTK corrections to ensure that the drone follows the flight plan more accurately. The LiDAR has been mounted on the fully assembled drone. We covered this process in another video. Put the drone into an open airspace. We're in an office right now, but let's imagine this is the survey site. If you're performing this survey in winter, it is recommended that both the drone and the LiDAR acclimatize to the outside temperature. Take the batteries and insert them into the drone. Turn on the controller by pressing the button twice. Once the controller switched on, you may turn on the drone also by pressing the button twice. The drone will indicate that it's ready for work. In order to turn on the LiDAR itself, you must press and hold the power button for at least three seconds. The LiDAR is connected to the power source via the Skyport and the scanner's telemetry is being transferred to the remote controller. Stand by for around 90 seconds while the scanner tests all of its systems and prepares for the survey to begin. As soon as the scanner initializes, the LED blinking will become a permanent light. You may begin the survey. First, you must start the data acquisition from the GNSS and the IMU. Tap the power button. If you're using the button to operate the system, it will take 10 seconds for the scanner to prepare for survey. You must upload the flight plan into the drone, run the kinematic initialization, and it will perform the survey automatically. Once the automatic survey is complete and the drone lands, you must switch the LiDAR into the static initialization mode. The device will automatically close the project after 10 seconds. You may begin your next survey. In this video, we showed how to easily perform a survey with the Alpha Air 450 using one button control. It is also possible to operate the Alpha Air 450 directly via the DJI Pilot program installed on the remote control. This will be the topic of our next video. Hmm.